In this episode, we'll be continuing our journey on the River Trent, cruising a few miles from Farndon into Newark and exploring this lovely small town. On the left there you can see the weir that takes the main channel of the River Trent round the north side of Newark. We make sure to steer away from the weir and keep to the right. The waterway narrows after the weir and takes boats into the centre of the town on the Newark branch.
This is the Newark Crusader, which is a charity run entirely by volunteers. It's an accessible boat that's been taking disabled, elderly and disadvantaged groups on Trent River cruises since the early 1990s. As we approached Newark Town Lock, there was a boat already in the lock, so we had to wait. Clear of the lock gate area. Please keep clear of the lock gate area. Please keep clear of the lock gate area. As the boat left the lock, the light turned green which gave us permission to enter the lock. Like the other locks on the River Trent, this one was automated and there was a lock keeper on duty controlling the lock from his control room. When the lock had emptied, the gates were opened and Pete moved out to wait for me to come down to him. And we cruised towards the magnificent Newark Castle overlooking the river. In 1135, King Henry I granted the Bishop of Lincoln permission to build a castle. It was originally built in timber, but was rebuilt in stone towards the end of the 12th century.
There was a space that we could have just about squeezed on at the end of the visit to Moorins but we'd pre-booked a spot at the King's Marina because we were leaving the boat to go down south to visit family for birthdays and anniversaries. ahead and the marina would let us know which berth was reserved for us. finally settled in another new home for a few days. Here's our walk around Newark and you'll see why we came to love this small town.
Join us next time as we continue our journey to Cromwell Lock and make preparations for our trip on the Tidal Trent. As always, thanks for watching and if you've enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and leave us a comment. We'd love to read them.